I'm at this temple here. One and Anya are having something to eat. This is not the actual temple that we're going to. This is not the actual temple we were going to, but um, gonna have a look in here and shoot a bit of video. these temples are very very similar but they are very beautiful and really worthwhile having a look at so yeah I've got the mic on so I'm hoping that the sound is going to be okay and uh, just going to go and have a look in this simple uh, second temple in this complex and uh, give you the name and everything of it a little bit later on Maybe in the description of the video or later on just when we before I leave I'll find the name of this temple. We are in China and we're actually going to look at the really spectacular glass temple which is in called Wat Ta Sung. So just gonna have a quick look in this one here, so let's have a look. allowed in the temples. Buddhist people love animals apparently. Although I have seen some cruelty. Some ask what's you know poisoned the family dog earlier during the week. So that's it for this one. I'm gonna go to the other temple that we wanted to look at now, so I'll see if I can try and find out the name of this temple here. But uh, yeah, so it's back on the bike. I think we've got a kilometer to go to the next one anyway, so maybe we'll stop and have something to eat after we go there. Maybe before, it just depends on Wana and Anya if they're hungry. Although they've just been eating now, so. Yeah, let's go and have a look around it. There they are, waiting, waiting, waiting. Starting to get a little bit more rain now, so I think we'll get on the bike and get going. Hi, Wat Sung. Okay, so now we're at Wat Sung. 
which is pretty amazing. I've been here before and uh, it's pretty incredible inside. It's all glass and mirrors, all the pillars, the ceiling, everything. It's absolutely fantastic. Anyway, you'll see when we get in there. So here we go. Uh, it's a little bit difficult at the moment because of all the COVID restrictions and so many people being here. They come here by the busload. Reverence to the King, the Queen, the most recent King, and most recent Queen. So now we've got to get a ticket and everything to get in here. It's become quite a tourist attraction. Pop on a cup. All the COVID restrictions. Writing the name and the phone number and everything. This is tiresome and stuff, but. Thailand has got a very good control on COVID, unlike Australia at the moment. And uh, those restrictions are, are still on, although there's a fair amount of freedom now. There's no more curfew, bars are open, lots of things are open again. But you've still got to check in everywhere so that if they get one case, they can track it right back to the phone number and where you were, who was there. Yep, they keep really good control over that. Okay, so here we go. Wow! These are all columns, by the way. They're not chandeliers, they're columns. Mirrors on the ceiling. Mirrors everywhere. Mirrors everywhere. It's mind boggling. Okay, so I've changed the setting to incandescent light, which gives you a better picture of what it's like because it's not golden, it's all uh, white and silver. So, pretty amazing looking place. Pretty amazing. And as you can see, mirrors on the ceiling. There I am. Okay, so you can see there's lots and lots and lots of people here. The place is packed and it's, it's only nine o'clock in the morning.
course, like all religions, it's all about collecting money. You know, it's money that makes these temples the way they are. And uh, money, of course, that uh, provides everything for them. What's the name of this place? Moonsake. Yes, Moonsake. Moonsake. Yes. Ni? Sake Krang. Sake yes. Krang. Yes. Sake Krang River. Hi. Hi, Thailand Dreaming. Very good. So, a really pleasant little place, just right on the side of the river. Quite nice. I've got a. Uh, it's almost like a mock English phone booth there. Uh, I don't know if they have upstairs or not. I think they do actually. But we're not going upstairs. But yeah, it's a really, really nice place. With nice river frontage views. Very nice indeed. So we've got uh, Masamantari. What's this one, honey? Kaya Kaya Masaman. New Masaman. Yes, Masaman Kai. Anika Masaman Kai. Mm. Two, cow. two different uh, Masaman Kai. One of a really nice looking pad pie. Pad pie, Kai Jiao Yipun. And we've got some uh, scrambled eggs. And I've got to tell you, it's absolutely delicious. I'll be putting a description of where this place is and how to get there. I'm really enjoying this after that long bike ride up here and wandering around the temple and shooting video. This is just delicious. The Masaman curry, it's a sweet Masaman curry, it's just beautiful. To die for. So thanks for watching the video and uh, if you like those videos and uh, you'd like to make some comments please go ahead and comment. Uh, I really need some input and some feedback from everybody and uh, don't forget to hit that uh, subscribe button. Uh, I want to thank everyone that's uh, got me to 50 subscribers, that's uh, fantastic, I feel really good about that. And uh, yeah, hit the subscribe button, like the video, share the video, and uh, until then, I'll see you next time. Thank you.